Outdoor and Technology TV for today. Right. We are going to hunting. So me and my brethren, Soji, we soon get Soji, Soji behind the camera right now. So we soon get Soji um, in our perspective view. So we can see my brethren, Soji. So for today, we are going hunting. So we just jump in a Soji um, um, F 150 truck here and we head up in a Sterling Forest. So what we're there right now, we're up a Sterling Forest up in a tuxedo, New York. Come so you know, to kind of give um, the viewers them a kind of a look and how this place is set up. Now we did expect to come over here this morning and uh, sign up and stuff, but it look like them closed this morning. Uh, by the way, today are Thanksgiving. This is our normal tradition. Me and soldier to come out, come do some hunting for Thanksgiving. Um, we, we go for either what turkey. We not the turkey, so you know just deer. And yes, um, but so you have to you have to have a choke for for the. For the shotgun. So for the we shotgun. Have the today. So Soji have him tagged. Me not really tagged out. Um, so we're just run with Soji. So let me just go around and just get a view of the magic of the field. So this is how we have him tried to go inside. So sign here to hunting season. Um, and now we come back to our 1st of February um, 28. So it's a nice little park set up. Run at the back. You can also do some fishing and stuff so come with your soldier and give them a good shot run at the back so them soldier and go because the thing is that most people don't have wear say them amenities are um, available to them in a new year you understand what I mean so we just are kind of give a highlight to show some of the amenities them um, where you can take advantage of um, in other places alright so as much as you can do your own thing yeah yeah, it's scenery. It's a scenic sight. Yeah, a nice scenic view to I can do hiking. So if you look over here, you can see some basically you can go down here and yeah. do fishing and stuff. All right. Go down, go down the, um, the aisle. So, a nice to walk and it says you can also the opportunity to hike, right? So you can do that. So go down the aisle. today. So. All right, so you jump up, I'm going to head down to the hunting area and then we can bring No, we can place. go down to the... Down here? Yeah. Down, down the alley. Yeah, right down the alley. We start the terrain right now. Right. <laughs> we start the terrain right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a nice cap of shoes to pay Alright? Yep. So, so we just make a jump off and we use up with knee. So, at least we know. So, well, then we need fresh uh, outdoor hunting. tech TV. Now, what we are going to do, normally we just hunt by line of sight. Uh, but for today, we're going to try a different technique. We actually navigate our way back into the woods. The last time we came here, it snowed a lot. And um, we kind of lost a way coming back out of the woods the last time. So, we want to take a better precaution today. So, what we're going to do is. Um, we're going to use the iPhone um, to kind of find our true north. Um, so basically, and then also find the location 41 degree north, 74. And not only that, we're going to also use um, the uh, compass uh, to set the true north and move along at like a true north bearing. Um, not necessarily um, because that's where we want to go, but just to be on the safe side. Uh, if we lose signal from the phone, you go on it. We rely, rely back on the compass and back ourselves out. Um, through on the car to By through north. Um, right. Going through south at, at, at that time. So this is the map that we have here for the forest. For the control so lines. So we up with the control lines and such. We know where through north is. Uh, so what we'll have to do is find our reference point on the map and then move from there and use the compass. So stay tuned. Go along with the grid. Right. Go along with the grid. <laughs> First again. Here we are again. We don't know COVID. <laughs> Thank God this time we have the opportunity can do like a hike and hunting because it didn't snow, so we can don't see any deer. So what uh, gear are you carrying, the soldier? Ah, uh, 
what um, equipment you're, you're, try, you're using for hunt? What rifle? What's the uh, caliber the and model? Um, what, what's the model? 206, same point. Same, uh, Who make it? Uh, Remington. Remington. <coughs> Remington. 742. Okay, cool. All right. Remington. Yeah, yeah. sidearm with you? Yes. 9, nine millimeter Browning. Okay, all right. So good, so we're going to get packed up and well, we're going to hit the woods, okay? Well, all right. um, <laughs> for backup, safety, yep. in case, we, in case uh, the uh, beer charges. us. <laughs> Our bad beer. Because the half thing can have um, come. Yeah. All right, so we found some evidence or um, possibility of where there might be some game trails. There are acorns all over the place. Um, so more than likely animal might feed on it. So what I'm really looking for right now is any sign of traps um, or any game trail what might lead me in that direction. Because the last time we came around it snowed, which, was, uh, which made the condition really prime to at least pick up some traps for the hunting. But today, there is no snow. So what we have to do today is basically um, go old school and try to trap the animal looking for footprint, um, any type of condition, food, water that we know we can use it to them. And not only that, and also look for game trail. So, and we have a glass a lot today because um, we're not necessarily in our position to pick up the tracks easily as we could. Uh, so, a lot of glass in and try to get some game trail. Um, I think what we're going to do. We're going to go up a little bit more and then at least glass some more and look for some more game trails. Stay tuned. All right, guys. Um, so we've been going up the trail and so far we haven't found any evidence um, of any wildlife. So what we're going to do, I think we need to get to some higher elevation um, to at least glass and, you know, take some shots uh, with the binoculars and see if we see anything. So, there's a rock further up um, there. You can see uh, what we're going to do is navigate to that rock. And at least from there, where that's the high elevation, we should be able um, to get some good visual to see if there's any wildlife. But to be on the safe side, what we're going to do is to make sure that we use a compass because, again, we're coming off the path, but we're going to use a compass to set a bearing. So, bearing right now is a true knot. Um, we're still on the true knot part, um, so we're going to do so. If we're if in the event when we're coming back, all we need to do is to travel south um, to intersect back with the um, with the path here that we're coming off. So we're locking and we come past and we're going up the hill to see if we get a better elevation and get some good sights. All right, peace out. Okay. <laughs> Mm -hmm. A nice, yeah, man, a nice piece to make a good staff, man. I cut this up, yeah, a good length, right? Mm -hmm. Is that length of a staff? Yeah, because normally Sport you always have your thing, but we have to make one of the woods because you normally have one where you bring or ready made, so. <laughs> Because it was a quick thinking today if we go hunting, we just have to make one and utilize the equipment. So that's what we're doing if you're wondering why you guys sign out in the woods. We're trying to make a staff where you can't see soldier going up daily. Alright? Stay tuned. Alright. Have a stop to catch your breath. <laughs> <laughs> it's all the we just have tried. I think only soji alone they need a staff, but guess what? Younger guys need staff. Me are young, so we can't say young people need staff. Younger guys need staff too. So I, I guess we're about halfway um, up the hill. So we have to take our time, catch your breath. Um, to get to, Soji and show, to the rock. Uh, fan around and show the um, subscriber that we were heading to and the viewers then. We're actually heading up over that rock, um, which at that point we should be able to get some good elevation and glass around and see if there's any um, opportunity to get any um, deer. deer or shot at a wildlife so 
stay tuned. We ought to do the right thing and we ought to do it for now. But one thing for sure too, you know, this is, you see this hunting thing is tricky, you know, because folks believe you just put on your clothes and you jump out there. Because coming up the hill, we dress to stay warm, but as you're coming up the hill, the, why this you're is talk. important, you have to lay up. Mm -hmm. So as you lay up, like here now, I can drop this shirt if I choose, please do. I can drop this one, this, um, I can drop the hoodie. And you know, just daily, just coming down on my legs until my body cool down again. So it's very important if you're going out, either hiking or hunting, to make sure you're dressed in a layers. Don't just one thick, heavy, bulky jacket like a goose down jacket, but dress up in a multiple layers, thermal, different thermal layers, your hunting shirt. So you can, as you're going up, you can just strip down as you get hot and stay cool. All right? Peace. So stay with us. First shot. Well, I guess we were walking, finally I start pee off and ended up a higher elevation. This is the first sighting of actually any um, evidence of deer. And what we're looking at here is deer dropping. Um, well, a normal hunter, some of them guys will pick this up and taste it, but we're not going to do that. We are Jamaican. Um, so we're going to try to crush the wood. So, for, for, so basically what we're trying to do is crush it uh, to kind of estimate how long the dropping has been there. So we just suggest that there's deer in this area. So what we need to do now is to figure out the truck, see if we can pick up a truck from this dropping, because the deer had to go in, in one direction or the other. So what I'm going to do is try to see if we can pick up some trucks um, based on this um, um, dropping and see which direction the deer went into. So stay tuned. Um, we may be able to share some meat with you if we get lucky. So wish we luck. Peace. Why well, soldier still has to lug it over the hill? Whew. Tired soldier. Sure, I know hill this way, my lad. Yeah, because we put it here, did you forget up top? I'm still on my feet. Look how far we're coming down from people. Yeah, All the way. Down there. Almost to the top, at least this section. Okay, if you look at the rest of the um the mountain peaks nearby so we're almost at the same level with the rest of the peaks them behind me so so you finally make it up uh, so I'll keep going so right now we're trying to get a bearing back um supposed to be heading south back to a vehicle but not only that south intersect us with a track nearby that would come off road once we get to the track, we can go straight back down. But and, right now, and the wall. we have to navigate. And what we're looking at, but Soji, check it out. See track the right ahead. Come. Mm -hmm. On oh, the stream. Yeah. That past the stream, right? Yeah, right, right. Back right. Into the right. Where we started. So, so good navigation. Yes. Good navigation. Mm -hmm. so good. Alright. Stay tuned. Uh, we're working way back to the car. We never we wasn't able to um get any animals, but at least it was a nice experience. Yes. Some good a lot of a lot of guys a lot of guys try but <laughs> was didn't succeed. So it's not just us, right? It, it was there for three days. So we only have a couple of hours. Right. All right. Peace. All right. <laughs> well, the hunt wasn't successful, as you see, uh, based on um, the shots them that we uh, presented earlier in the video. But it was a nice workout uh, for me. I'm uh, for me. I'm a general. Yeah. So we did get a lot of exercise. We did find some droppings and one truck but because the, the, the bushes were so um, thick vegetation we couldn't track it any further but then if you look up on the top of that hill mountain mountain that's all the way we got at least um, at the extreme apex um, we went up there just to, 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 to the side so we did our best um, so at least try to at least get some visual or you know track animal but it didn't work out today as you can see condition isn't conducive uh, you can't track 
um, deers and necessarily I run around them time of day in a condition like this. So we'll keep trying. Stay with us next time. Dukes, take Good the, breeding Dukes, exercise. Dukes outdoor and tech TV. Good breeding exercise. Good breeding exercise. Yes. <laughs>